Hello everyone. Today I want to share how to make the fake lens blur or like bokeh photo with Photoshop with simple step and a little bit adjustment uh, to the color. Okay. First what we want to do is we must select this model using quick selection tool. Okay, I just use quick selection tool. Okay, just select. Don't to detail, it's okay. But make sure you select the body area. Okay. And remove selection a little bit here. Uh little bit here okay don't worry about this area we can fix it later okay 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 next click refin edge okay to use refin edge you must use photoshop cc okay next set radius to 1.7 smooth around 7 pixel feeder about 1 pixel and shift edge about minus 5 and after that using the refin radius tool brush the edge of the selection okay it make your selection smoother like this just was the edge okay okay it make you bring back the detail from the hair see the detail from the hair okay after that output to new layer with layer mask click ok after that okay after that click background Duplicate again the background. Duplicate. See, and turn off this layer. After that, using the lasso tool, select the model. Don't to detail. It's okay. You select like this. Okay, after you make the selection, click Edit, Fill, Use Content Aware, and click OK. It will remove the model from the background. And after that, click select, deselect. Okay, now we have two layer for model and background. At this layer, we click filter, blur, and lens, lens blur. Okay, you can use many type of blur, and I use octagon. And don't forget to set the radius. Okay, you can set anything you want, but more bigger the radius, more blur the background. Okay, I make the 100% to make the background more blur.
Okay. After that, set distribution to Gaussian. Okay. Okay. Now we have the fact lens blur, but to make it more realistic, make new layer here, new layer. Use the white color and use brush. Set opacity around thirty percent and set the brush size like here make the light from the background okay after that to make the realistic tone to make it more blend we can use select selective color change the yellow to make it more warm tone Like this okay click here make selective color once again okay next we use the hue saturation set to plus 10 and make new layer again pick the color with eyedropper tool I want to make light from this color just click pick after that click brush change the size okay I will click here and change to screen and make adjustment with level level Slide a little bit the mid tone and the shadow to make the model more pop up from the background. And I'm finishing using color look up, color look up, change to Fuji Eterna and change the opacity. You can use another uh, effect. Uh, I, I usually use film stock and Fuji Eterna. Okay. Let's. I make the group to show you the before and after. Okay. I hope you enjoy it. Uh, and can practice with your photo if you have another question you can comment below don't forget to like share and subscribe thank you